Spencer Lazar with the legend Boss Rutten. So how are you doing tonight? How does it feel to get out for, uh, from the Pancrase days all the way to the video game days, it seems? It's crazy, right? Yeah, now suddenly I'm here. Just to start doing Grand Theft Auto, start destroying people there, got a little bit too violent. The people at Grand Theft Auto, I asked them how violent they wanted to have it. They said, give it all you got. And within an hour, they came down and they said, stop right there. We don't need anything more. So I thought that was quite a compliment, you know. And then to come out in a video game, which is, you know, a game where you can actually learn and get better your character, that is something just uh, unheard of. How awesome is it to have it so realistic, not only the graphics, but the moves that the fighters are making? It, yeah, yeah, it's like you said, you know, I was talking about it today and I think, I, I truly believe that fighters, when they're playing this game, they will actually see some setups that they say, I'm going to try that out tomorrow when I train, because it's really that realistic. And uh, what do you think about uh, Brock and Kane this weekend? You got any predictions for us? You know, I, I, uh, uh, when Brock all shied away from the punches and he didn't pull guard, you know, I gave him a little bit of heat on my show and inside MMA, you know, deserved, you know, and he should take it as constructive criticism. But then when I watched the primetime with him, I got a whole new respect for Brock, man. It's like, he's a good guy and the, his, 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 the, his training, his workout ethics, it's, 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 it's unheard of. He's like... It's like a machine, you know, and, uh, and I, I really appreciate that. I uh, hope that he really worked on that, and he's going to need it against Kay Velasquez. You know, what uh, I, I, I used it today also. I was watching the old uh, Muhammad Ali, oh no, uh, Mike Tyson documentary, and, and he, uh, Tyson said, the motto all the time told me, speed kills, speed kills, you know, and that's one of these things that I think in this fight is going to play a factor. If it's going to be a victory by Brock, it's probably going to be in the first round by a cut, you know, I think if you can take him down, drop some elbows and get some cut, that might anti fight. But if Kane get, can get up and get get up again and get get up again, you know, he's got the stamina of a yeah, 135 pounder. And uh, I think that's going to play a major factor. Although, all the things that I said to cr the critic about um, uh, Brock, there's one thing his work ethic is unbelievable and he's always in shape. You know, as a fighter, I can't stand it when people run out of gas because it's your job. You should not be able to run out of gas.